Hello and welcome back to the channel. Uh, I appreciate all the love and support that you've shown me on my content so far. Uh, I really appreciate you being here. I'm very, very, very close to 100 subscriptions, so uh, I don't take anything for granted. Uh, I'm gonna celebrate every, every milestone, no matter how big or small it is. I like stickers. I like designing stickers. So when the sunroof on my very, very, very old paid off car sprung a leak, I thought to myself, hmm, here's an opportunity to create the biggest sticker of my life. Check this out. Okay, so, so far so good. Uh, I put this temporary uh, leak proof cover on my car just to make sure that the idea of putting a branded kind of graphic over the top will work. And so here's what it looks like right now. Let me turn this camera around for you. So here I am in Adobe Illustrator. This is where I will be laying out uh, the top of the decal for the top of my car. So uh, I laid out the background color here and this file and the image is to scale. So I know that it will fit on top of my uh, car. So after I had the rough dimensions kind of laid out, it's all about placing the uh, sticker designs that I already have uh, in place, how I want them to look on top of the car. So the first thing I did was I measured the top of my car and established a trim line where uh, I need to cut off excess material once it's printed. And then I just went about selecting the stickers I wanted and placing them on top of the car. So I'm just gonna reveal each sticker to you, how I decided to lay them out on top of the car, uh, my high school logo, uh, some other stickers that I have, and I will leave a link to the description in the description of where you can look at and find these stickers on my website. So I just went through and I played around a little bit with uh, the layout. Oh, there's an onion. I want to just kind of throw that in there for laughs. Uh, my wife's business logo. If you go to the logos here and sticker designs. And that was it. Pretty straightforward. Uh, that's the final design. And we'll move on to the next part of this video where I'll show you um, the layout and installation of this. Uh, well, I'll show you a little bit of it getting printed out and the installation of the sticker. Here I am with the final design being printed on vehicle wrap paper. Shout out to Mr. Mazzola for the fine, fine work that you always do for me. Okay, YouTube, my hand has been forced. I had a plastic trash bag covering my car sunroof because it was leaking. So I came up with the bright idea of kind of printing a graphic to cover the top of it to stop the leak. And uh, I wasn't planning on starting the project for another couple weeks, but I was driving home today and the bag split and I know that rain is in the forecast. So I'm going to go ahead and try to apply the graphic. I don't know if I'll be able to get the footage of me actually applying the graphic or not because uh, it's just me solo. So uh, we'll see what happens. Uh, I should have before and afters for you guys to take a look at. 
So here's the graphic that I have that I created using some of the uh, sticker decals that I have, I've designed, and it's just kind of hanging on my wall. I put it on my wall because it printed out on a roll, so I wanted to try and flatten it out over time. So I'm gonna take this down, trim it to the measurements of the top of my car, and go outside and try to apply it. Stay tuned. So here's the car, top of it. Had the plastic bag up there, came off. So I had a video of that for you guys, but actually <laughs> made a mistake because I'm a rookie and filmed in the wrong orientation. So maybe I'll get some screenshots of that, but that's where I'm starting and that's what I'm working with. So here you can see the inside of the car and the water damage, how it hit the seat, left a stain. I'll have that clean once I get the graphic on it, both sides, so. So here's the uh, preliminary tape down job prior to trying to install the graphic. Have it kind of laid down in place. Had to make some trim revisions. But all in all, we'll see what happens. Fingers crossed this works. If not, well, I don't have a choice. <laughs> we'll see you soon. Okay guys, here it is. Turned out a little rougher than I expected. I mean, trying to lay something flat over a sunroof is probably not the best thing, but it's more of a functional patch to stop the leaking. From a distance, it looks pretty good, but I mean, there's definitely some, some wrinkles in there, but like I said, car still runs. I'm just trying to keep the water out, so. go so we had a hard rain last night and looks like everything is still good no issues Wow, so how'd you like that? Car still running, still no leaks. Thank you so much for sticking around to the end. If you like this video, please consider subscribing to the channel. Uh, it would mean a lot to me and it'll help my channel grow and I'll see you in the next video.